round and round it goes. Found heaps of algae and gunk in uh, this sample of fuel. Pumped up more and more and changed it again and look at this, just uh, loads of algae and gunk down the bottom. This is a Toyota Hilux filter, no problems with it being a Hilux, but we have a look at the fuel filter. Absolutely, probably not a millimetre left of room in there for any contamination of gunk. I mean, the filter element is absolutely as flat as a pancake and everything's just, you know, black and sooty and crappy. So this probably hasn't been changed for a long time. Um, surprisingly though, when filters block up, they start bringing on lights and everything in vehicles and this is what ends up happening in the end. So don't get to that point. Get your filters changed regularly. We say every time you get your oil and filter changed, say every 10,000, change a fuel filter. Some of these vehicles that have their 15 and 20,000 K services, well, probably you should be sneaking in an oil change a bit earlier anyway, but make sure that fuel filter gets changed. Otherwise, you'll go on a trip and you'll end up getting caught. And then, of course, that's when all the troubles start. So as we say, leave with a clean filter. Just from earlier, another filter over here, same deal, black as. Guys, just don't let that happen. Make sure you change your diesel filters super regularly. Whether you're fitting pre-filters or whatever you do, make sure you change your filters regularly. That's really the key to this whole issue of fuel contamination with diesels coming down to that. You can see more of these videos on our Facebook, YouTube channel, or go to berrimadiesel.com for more technical information and articles.